Where do I even start? So far, Modern Warfare Remastered is a huge pile of gold. It's a huge pile of gold. What's up, guys? I'm Focus, and welcome back to the channel. Real quick, I think it's important that I give a shout out to you guys, all of my subscribers, for all the continued support. Yeah, yeah. Well, thank you, Andy. Thanks. The likes, the shares on all my videos. We're growing pretty decently at a, at a decent pace. Today, guys, we're going to be taking a look at Modern Warfare Remastered's early access campaign on the PlayStation 4. <laughs> Most of the time, I script out my videos or I outline my videos so I know what I want to talk about. So I was sitting down today and I was scripting out this video and I couldn't really convey the emotion that I was feeling after playing through it last night on, on stream. So I just figured I'm going to record this video raw, do a little bit of editing. But real quick, before we jump into it, in the comment section below, guys, let me know if you've already gotten your grubby little hands on the early access campaign for Modern Warfare Remastered, and if so, like out of a, a 10 score, what would you give it? I'm, I'm a big fanboy of this game, first off, so I'm going to just throw that out there to you guys. I'm a huge fanboy of this game, but for the purpose of this video, I'm going to try and put that fanboyism aside and talk about Modern Warfare Remastered. Now, for those of you that uh, pre-ordered and paid off or did it through the PlayStation Network, the Legacy Edition or, and, or higher you have access to, on PlayStation 4, you have access to the campaign. And the pure, raw emotion is so hard to convey. <laughs> like, if you go back and watch the VOD from last night's stream, I was just beside myself playing because it was... <sighs> Raven Software, man, I gotta give it to you. You guys are fucking awesome. All right, so you load into it, and you've got the theme music and everything. It, it sounds so good. It, it's so reminiscent, and you load into it, and you just, if for, those of you, if for those of you that know what I'm talking about, the feeling playing this game, and, and what it was like years ago playing it for the first time, like, that all comes back. First thing you notice is the graphics are gorgeous. It's beautiful. They added little things here and there that you just notice that sort of bring it like to the current times. Things like little bit like little animations and stuff like climbing over things and whatnot. And it, it doesn't feel any different than it ever has. They just added these smoother animations to make it feel like it's a, a, a new generation game. They did a fantastic job. So I'm going to talk about the gameplay. So the gameplay is exactly as I remembered it. And not only is it exactly as I remembered it, get this, the, the best single player mission in any game ever, at least in my opinion, all gillied up, okay? Not only did they make it to where I can enjoy that again as if it was the very first time playing it, they made it better. It looks better. It sounds better. It plays better. It was like playing it for the first time all over again. It was absolutely insane. I... I can't even say enough, like everything about it. So I'm sitting here playing it last night, right? And I'm streaming and I'm playing it and I'm talking to people in the chat. And we're having a great time. But in the back of my head, I'm thinking, I'm always so let down by games that are hype for this and hype for that. So I'm playing it and I'm like, you know, this is good. Like, th this is good. I'm enjoying this. This is fantastic. And I think... I'm waiting for that one thing to happen that's just like, oh, they fucked the game up, man. You know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm waiting for that one thing where the, it's like they fucked it up. And I'm playing, and I'm playing, and we're going through the missions. We're getting trophies. We're having a great time. And that time, that, that moment never came. All the way up until the very end of the missions. And I sat back, and I was just thinking, I'm like... They fucking did it. They did it. They absolutely did it. Now, I remember reading an article a while back. Um, I don't remember the guy's name exactly. He was an original developer for Modern Warfare. And I remember he called and spoke with the developers 
uh, Raven Software, and his on the record, it was so funny, his on the record comment was strictly this, don't fuck it up. That was his on the record comment. He said, this game means so much to so many people, don't fuck it up. And they didn't. Now, like sound, okay, We're, let's talk about the sound. The sound's better. It's more, it sounds more high fidelity. It, 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 it just sounds better. Now, it's no like Battlefield Frostbite sound engine, but Call of Duty never really was a, necessarily about like the sound and whatnot. But they updated it. It sounds more high def. It sound, the guns sound great. Uh, we even went back and tested the Deagle to see what it sounds like. Sounds exactly like it sounded before. Now, that was one of the guns that they had tweeted out. Mr. Amos Hodge had tweeted out saying that they had went back or they were going back and making it sound more like the original. And that's the truth. Because we went back to Crew Expendable and we tested the thing. And it sounds great. It sounds powerful. It's got a lot of kick. Like, there's, there's nothing. There's nothing in this game when I was playing it last night that stood out to me that was like, what are they thinking? What are they doing? Like everything was spot on. Everything was exactly how I remembered it. Everything was perfect. There, it blew my mind. I, when I got off stream last night, I was tweeting out and I was just so excited. I was still so excited. We streamed for like six and a half hours last night. And we finished the campaign on regular. We're going to go back and get the rest of the trophies and finish this platinum challenge over the next, you know, couple weeks while we're waiting for the game to launch. So at this point in time, it is a 10 out of 10 for me. And this is strictly speaking about the campaign, okay? We've still got a whole other half coming of the game, the multiplayer. And that's mainly like the huge selling point for this game is the multiplayer. So as of right now, Raven Software, you've done a fantastic job. The controls feel great. The, the graphics are great. The gameplay is spot on. Everything is exactly... I don't even want to say exactly. It, it's, it surpassed my expectations for a remaster. Everything is freaking great. It's fantastic. And this is not the fanboy in me. This is speaking from a general gamer's perspective. Like, if I went fanboy, you, you probably would turn this video off right now. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Mm -mm. Fuck this shit, I'm out. No thanks. So, as of right now, it's perfect. It, it's it's absolutely perfect now come november the 4th i'll be doing a an entire review after i get my hands on the multiplayer and but if, if this is like any notion towards what we can expect from the multiplayer portion i mean <laughs> game of the year back in 2007 could it be possible that a remastered game could be game of the year like I, I couldn't even fathom it. It's so crazy how I'm feeling inside over this game. Now, you guys know SOCOM is my most loved franchise, my most loved games, but this right here, that's second to me. And the fact of that they didn't fuck it up, they actually provided something and they cared about the game and they cared about the players and they, they, they cared about everything that surrounds the game and what it means to people to meticulously bring it back to us in a glorious remastered version that's not just an upscale like it's completely redone if you don't have it and you're a call of duty modern warfare fan or was a fan or even just a little fan you would do yourself a disservice if you don't play this game so if you don't have it now come november the 4th buy modern warfare remastered get a free copy of infinite warfare and there you go so that's all i'm gonna say guys Hope you guys enjoyed this video. All my social media links will be in the description below. Why don't you swing through, check out my Twitch channel if you haven't already, make an account over there. The link will be in the description below. Smash that follow button. If you haven't already and you enjoyed this video, you enjoyed my video because there's gonna be a lot of Modern Warfare Remastered videos to come. Make sure you smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching. My name is Focused, and until next time, be safe and take care of each other. Thank you.